so exciting. I am literally buzzing. As you all know, we have three ponies, Popcorn, Claudia and Rolo, and we have a horse box that fits two, a trailer that fits two, and we've been wanting to take all of them to some competitions quite regularly now and we just can't because we, we need to get our granddad to bring um the trailer and then none of them have three like slots for the ponies to go in which is actually getting quite annoying now but that is all changing from today so me and my mum were thinking what can we possibly do to get all of the ponies to the same place for a show or just a day out so we were we stumbled across a absolute lifesaver and we cannot wait to be getting this out and showing you guys because we're gonna have so much fun with it this summer and i'm glad we got it just on the verge of summer as well because now we can get used to it and then we can just have so much fun with this i cannot wait so we had a couple options here to be able to get all of these ponies out together we had a, my mum will have to take a driving test to get a bigger bigger horse box that can fit three ponies that is also really expensive. Number two is just carry on with the horse box and trailer situation. All three, we get a horse trailer that's number one, gorgeous, and number two, so practical, that can fit three ponies. Three! Honestly, I am so excited to show you guys this. Chevelle Liberty Maxi 3, which means it can fit three ponies. I'm getting really excited about this because it is absolutely gorgeous. I, I'm seeing it right now, guys, and it is just... Let's get on with the tour, guys, so I can show you inside because this is not your normal everyday trailer, my dear. Let's right, carry on. So we're going to start off with the front here. It's got the lovely Chevelle Liberty sign and we went for a lovely grey as well. But I just wanted to say a massive thank you to Chevelle Liberty for working with us because this is just a dream come true. This is absolutely gorgeous. And then moving on to the side, I'm actually going to save the tack room for last. So I'll come back to that. Um, there's, this is the Maxi 3. It's actually not that long either, which is really, really nice. There's a lovely window there, and that is not just the best window you've ever seen. You'll see an even better one in a second. But we thought that this here was really cool because it's mesh and you can close it whilst you have horses in there. So no one can see in, no debris or leaves can fly in whilst you're driving along but it's also really breathable as well. So you just take it off like this with the rubber hooks. And it's actually very, very cool because you don't have to like roll it up or anything. It just goes up like that, which is so handy. And then if you need to bring it back down, you just step on here and then pull it back down. And it's super easy. I also love these like hooks you just pull, push that there and then they come open i find that really really handy um a lot easier and then you just do the same also if your horse doesn't like ramps you can open it like a door so your horse can just step up into the trailer so we actually might do that as well that's actually a really cool feature but i love the ramp how it's not that deep like steep and deep as well it's nice and shallow and just overall quite welcoming but they've got this little bar here to keep your horse in here we have three partitions and this is just absolutely amazing i just can't wait to take all the boys out together so i'm going to show you how it works so you just do the same to the top and the bottom so you pull it down you can make this shorter so you can get into the partitions more easily and you can open it up it's all very well built. And then open it. So this little built-in strap will hold the partitions in place so they can't come out. And here we have it. Look how cool this is. It's absolutely amazing. And I also love this padded wall here. It's like meshy kind of foam. So if you're like going around a roundabout or something, your horse can just lean on this, you know, get a bit of support. Um, but now is my favorite bit. We're gonna go to the outside. Are we ready, guys? Okay, right. Me and my mum are obsessed with this feature. We can't wait till we're at our show in the summer and even in the winter. 
and the ponies can just be popping their heads out, you know, having a little nose because popcorn is very nosy. <laughs> So if you've got a horse on the end partition just there, you can pull this down so you can get them out and just them. So look how awesome that is. I just am buzzing with this. This is very cool because it's got a ramp at the front, at the front and a ramp at the back. So if you've got a pony on this side or the end, it doesn't mean you've got to take that ramp down just to get the pony that's on this side. So I am just in love with this. I just, oh, it's amazing. And this is also gonna protect you from the wind, like from the rain as well. Like if it's raining, it's a little camp shelter. If I was Popcorn, I'd be pretty chuffed with this because Popcorn's quite nosy and he loves to have a little, hmm, it's getting on over here. <laughs> so he'd absolutely lap this up. He just, stand and have a little snooze in the sun and every time a horse would walk past he'd prick his ears forward have a little nose here and there and then go back to sleep and this is how easy it is to close the windows it works super quick you just put your foot, foot up on here come up grab the velcro Yay. step back down and then reattach the velcro there and then tuck it in and then you can do these back up one and two. Oh, Holland's waving there. There's also loads of windows for ventilation that open at about halfway and then close it up. This is if we were packing away at the end of the show and you can also open and close these. There's also these up here, there's two of them, which is so good for ventilation on a really hot day if we're traveling. So at the side here, this is the tack room. So it's got a lovely door. And then there's even a mirror. Like guys, this is ultra fancy. You can put your hair nets and hair brushes in here to keep them nice and safe. And then you step up and this is a walk-in tack room inside the trailer. So we've got three lovely saddle racks here and they've got these wings on the side of them so they're not gonna fall off as well. Um, there's one low down, medium, and then one a bit higher. We're gonna hang all the bridles up here and I just cannot get over how spacious it is in here. But there is so much room in here to put hay, um, bedding, feed, show equipment and tack even there's so much room and they said you can pack your bedding and hay down here and then there's still loads of room for your saddles but this is just amazing to have a trailer and there'd be so much space and it'd be so organized but yeah we're gonna go get popcorn and see what he thinks of it good boy up we get Ten. off we go good boy just getting him used to it He's never, I don't think he's ever seen anything like this before. Good boy. Oh, we're pooing. Oh no. Oh, Pop, we're not traveling. We're just getting used to it, babes. You know, you're pooing in my new wheels. I was going to keep this to all that stinks as well. Look how much he's loving being a nosy boy. You love this, don't you? Get to be nosy. I knew he was going to love it. I just know exactly what he likes. This is literally going to be him at a show, nosing around, looking at all the ponies, seeing what they're doing. I actually seen this horse trailer on a fir for the first time on an eventing um, YouTuber's channel and I was I showed mum and she was like oh my word that looks amazing but you love this popcorn don't you I think you're having a good old time in here I think popcorn definitely loved that but I just wanted to show you that this whole bar here is actually a tie-up 
So you can tie your pony up here. If you put bailing twine on, then you can tie it up. Obviously, it's a safety hazard if you tie them up on metal as it's not a breakaway. But yeah, you can tie them up all along here. And what's great about this is there's actually like stoppers. So there's one here, 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 and then here. So there's a, their lead rope's not gonna go sliding all the way along up to the other lead rope. So you can just tie one there and then one there and they're not gonna slide along. He pooed in his new wheels. Like, I can't believe it, but it is gonna be used. It's not here for like decoration. We're gonna use it. It's gonna have to get dirty. I literally can't wait for the vlog of this, guys, where we take all three of them out in this. Like, it's gonna be absolutely hilarious. I've got my favorite shaving brand, Orbeos, here, and we, Popcorn has this all in his bedroom, and he absolutely loves it. So, this is coming in here. We're, this actually looks really easy to clean, um, the rubber matting, because it's, it's not really bumpy. So it looks nice and simple. There's no big gaps in here. And Granddad is definitely going to be jet washing this for us when it gets dirty. Um, pour some along here. Oh my gosh, this is a workout. So I love to put bedding down because I find it's a lot nicer if the ponies want to have a wee and it's easier to muck out in to get the, the poo out and it absorbs their pee pee if they have a wee, which is pretty much all of our ponies do every time we go out. That one bag actually did a good job of like filling this all up, but I'm not going to make it too like thick. I'm going to get all ready for our next outing, which is probably this weekend, uh, which is very exciting. Can't wait to use it. I think all our boys are really going to love their adventures together. I think they're all going to have such a good time and they're all going to enjoy spending a bit of quality family time together. They're going to love life. Popcorn's going to get to be nosy at shows, which he loves. My mum hasn't had to do her HGV test, but she's buzzing about because she does not want to do. I mean, she's all right. Like, she's never failed a driving test, have you? No. no, she's never failed a driving test. I passed the trailer test. She passed the trailer test on her first go, which is quite impressive, actually. No offence, Mum. And having a big lorry would have been so much money to run it. It would have been keeping it as well. It's, it's absolutely huge. Um, but this is just nice and simple and straightforward. All you've got to do, hitch it up to the car. This has just been really practical and it's the perfect solution for what we've needed, really. I just can't wait for all the adventures that we're gonna have this summer with all the boys. But yeah, thanks so much to Cheval Liberty and to all of you guys for watching today's vlog and I will see you soon. Bye.